Hello and welcome to Magsy's Fun Time. This is Magsy and we are back here on Hypixel Skyblock. This is a vanilla server. If you guys like this episode, make sure you smack that like button. It really helps out the channel with YouTube. If you should do search with YouTube back or the movement for the channel. If you subscribe to my channel and you want to get notifications when I have new videos up, all you got to do is go to my page, hit the notification bell, set your settings inside the notification bell. You'll get notifications whenever you want them, not just whenever YouTube wants to send them to you. And you come check out the videos. If you do like this video, you want to share it with your friends, tell them that you like it. There's a share tab down below. There's links there to the social media site. There's a link there for you to post wherever you want. I am uh, pushing for a thousand subscribers, so any help you can help out with that is good. Um, Let's see here. I really need another booster cookie. <laughs> uh, I don't think I have anything. Besides. On post. I could get more compost. How much would this sell for? Compost is not a problem for me. Yeah. Nothing. Okay. So, there's that. What about my other things? Do I have anything in here I can sell large amounts of? I have to, a crap ton of dark oak wood. I can always get more of that. Let's see. Thanks. Uh, I can sell jungle too. I need to get some more of that. There we go. Combat. I have 60 of these. There we go. No. I need those. Gunpowder's fine. Rotten flesh, I might need to use. Okay. Can't do those. I need those. How much is one diamond? Uh, yeah. Nice. I think that's enough. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I'm not going to be doing that on a regular basis. Uh, I just needed it for this time. Uh, I wanted to have a booster cookie on me to finish off the... Uh, um, Crimson Hollows quest line. We want to get be able to uh, go over there and do our dailies every day. And uh, I can't do that until I finish the quest line for them and then join the mage uh, part of it. So there is a couple things that I want to do today, but I might go over that with you guys. And then uh, I want to definitely want to get the, the the questing done today. If I don't get to those, I will do those off camera. So uh, what we're going to do is any of these guys over here that are maxed, they're coming up just temporarily. And uh, I really don't need this guy down just yet right now, but I'm going to leave him down. Um, this guy, uh, 
I don't need him actually down on here. I could take him up and I can just grind it in the crystal hollows. So I'm not worried about that. So uh, some of these guys are going to be coming up. Definitely, I've already maxed this guy up, so he's coming up. And uh, what we're going to do is all of the collections for mining that we have now because of the uh, uh, Crimson Isles, we're going to go ahead and put minions down of those. Now, some of these, when you craft them, they're, they're, they're required. there's a requirement on the levels. So if we come in here, nope. We come in here, Mycelium. Yeah. This is the mage one. Yeah, and the reason why we want this one first is... Um, Corruption, the mysterious mushroom cow pet. So we want to get this for our farming. And there's this armor that's that's really good for us. But in order to craft this, we need these things. And these things are really annoying to get from what I've read. Um, it's going to be something we'll have to go farm. But this is going to probably be my end game set for right now. Unless we start doing dungeons. Uh, the only thing that I found that it's better than this, the one I'm currently using, um, is stuff from the uh, boss in the, on the Crimson Isle. I forgot what it was called. It's like 700, uh, 750 intelligence. So, and then the Gauntlets of Contagion, we do we do need. We do need the Gauntlets of Contagion. So. Killing an enemy causes the explosion. Causes an explosion deal. Killing an enemy causes an explosion dealing 10% of the total health as damage to all enemies within two blocks. Enemies in the blast radius will also be contaminated causing them to explode yeah and it is leather and enchanted so so we are going to have to go find leather i believe it's from the the cows if i'm not mistaken but i, I can look that up yeah so stuff like that uh let's see like stuff like netherrack i've already maxed it out there's no minion for it uh, we can't get a magical lava bucket now if we wanted to. Um, Netherrack is one of those things where I can come in here now and I can make all these. See, there's no limit to them. So we're going to put some Nether, Nether Quartz minions down. And I kind of want to see how much money I can make off one Nether Quartz minion. So I might try to max one of them out first. We might just take all these up. Get one of each down and then try to... Uh, uh, see how much money I can get off a of max nether quartz minion in one day just to sell it at at the uh, the thing. We are still trying to get this maxed up, but I end up selling all my stuff, so I need to just stop and get all these maxed. Yeah, so this one needs 32 enchanted bells. This one needs 8 enchanted bells. So I need all these maxed. Uh, that's where we're at right now. Uh, let's go ahead and, oh, oh, there's something else. Uh, let's check over here for items. Okay, I have some more absolute enderpearls. I might sell those. Okay, there's nothing in there. Now, I do need to start, um... Grinding these out, wise armor would actually be an upgrade for me. So that means killing the Ender Dragons and hoping. That one's not bad. Instone Shocker. I don't think I have that many of those. I'm going to take this out of here, though, because this shouldn't be in there. That's kind of the stuff I was looking for. Yeah. All right. But 
what I was thinking about was um I'll put you in here. That'd be where I get that from anyway. I thought there was a power stone that you could get from over there. I don't know if I have it unlocked on this or not. The catalyst. I don't know. Let's go. Let's go check out over here. I'm Teddy is the one I want, but the one I've I've got right now. But I don't know if that's the maximum intelligent one. It's not. Inspired has 78. Why did I choose this one? That's a starter power. That's an intermediate power. Wrong one. Inspired. Um, let's switch to that. Yeah. More intelligence. Um, and I have been putting it, all of my stuff in, in intelligence. Uh, what I could do is try to buff uh, my stats. So, so when I'm holding this, let me put my armor on. This is my caster armor. Okay. When I hold this, my intelligence is 1,052. Um, but as you can see right there, my critical chance is not maxed. And I need that to be 100%. I believe it still counts that way for mage weapons. So I need to figure out a way to do that. Um, I do have heroic on here. Or the intelligence boost but I might have to change that to something else and slayer champion okay I do have smite um basically smite works on your damage <laughs> uh since you're not attacking, like physically hitting stuff with it, uh, most of the enchantments that deal with melee weapons don't count for this, but that, that one does. Now we can upgrade this and that might increase the damage some, but that's something we're, we are already working on. So um, my only other choice is these guys. Do these guys have reforges? Let's take one out and see. I might have to look up equipment, see if there's any that has intelligence on it. But come over here. And it'll tell me immediately. No, it does not. Now, there are reforges for for equipment, but that's it's not in there. So let's put that back on. I might have to look up equipment and see about that. Let me pause the video and I'll take a look at that, guys, and I'll bring you guys right back. Okay, we're back. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go out here. And um, take Y's here. And the Y's here. And... Oh, I don't have any money. Hold on. Wrong button. Withdraw, save, and okay. Should get us what we need. Okay, so it's going to take our intelligence down doing this. Mythic. That's what we want, I believe. Yeah, and we'll do this one. I 
I still want intelligence is the is the problem. Maybe. Mark. Light. Pierce. Come on, mythic. There we go. And now that didn't change it. <laughs> Why didn't that change it? Am I crazy? I'll have to look at the video. Yeah. I thought it was at 77. Now, I could use a pet that has critical strike on it. So. But that doesn't help me because I the sheep does increase damage. That's the one you usually want to use. And I don't really know. Well, there's the tarantula pet. It does have critical chance on it. I would need to start leveling it up. But it doesn't have intelligence on it. Oh, I have another tarantula pet. Why do I have two of them? Why do I have two of them? Um, I can't like sell these. Right. That's fine. What am I going to do with it? Keep it in my inventory? <laughs> I've got one. That's legendary. So this one's legendary. Yeah, I need to start leveling this for my spider slayers. Blue well. I use my tagger. That's not much of an increase, though, is it? I think I'm just stuck, right? Yeah. Griffin. Griffin might work. And you get extra magic find. It does give you an intelligence boost. Hmm. Yeah. An extra five percent. So if I put that on and then I go in here. Eighty two percent. I've dramatically lost intelligence though from this armor. I feel like if I want to max out my thing, I'm going to need different gear. <laughs> anyway, I'm wasting time. Let's get into the uh, Crimson Isles. Now, I did accidentally uh, complete the last quest. So uh, I will show you guys that. As you can see, my objective there, but we'll come over here. I think it's, no, it's this way, right? Yeah. So you come up here, and, uh, 
part of the quest was explore. I did the, the exploring, like I said, I was going to go off camera. And then uh, to start the quest, there's a staircase here. And you, you walk up there and it bounces you back down. And then she comes over here and talks to you. Now you're supposed to talk to mages. So what we have to do is basically just come over here. Talk to these people. Yeah. Like shop owners. Too strong for that tool. It's my drill. Weird. Okay, so. Come on. It's three. I'm not going to read down there, but you guys want to read down there. We do need an Abbey phone, but I'm not going to have to wait on that one. Another thing I can do is my, uh, my talismans. We can work on those. I don't have that many of them. Very lacking, so I might have to go through the guide. Maybe off camera today, I'll go through the guide and see how many of these I can get on Iron Man. The point is, it's it's on Iron Man. It's different than regular. <laughs> okay, so that's all of these. We need to go over to the Barbarian. So in order to do that, you want to come back down here. I don't know the Barbarian area that well because I've never done Barbarian, but you want to come back down here, go across these things here. Uh, another thing we might want to do. Let me get up here where it's safe. Another thing we might want to do is uh, come in here and get my shovel out. Because yeah, as I'm running along here, like like for this stuff, oh, I, I, I did this wrong too. You have smelting on you. That's why I was putting that up when I'm over here. So I'm going to put this up. Where, where did that go? No. Yeah. And we're going to get our heated one out here. Yeah, there we go. Now. And then when we get over here, we can switch to the shovel for the sand. And this here, you just come up these stairs right here. This is the barbarian area. Now you come in here until you get um, choose a choose a faction. So it's fine. This is their starting area. That's the path up to the top there. Uh, what we want to do is come over here and talk to people. So, and you can switch anytime. You know, to stick with one faction or the other. I think what some people will do is they'll choose one faction and level their reputation up to the point to where yeah, you have enough reputation where it'll cover the uh, crafting of the uh, minion for that faction. And then they'll switch factions and do it on the other side. And then they'll try to keep it like, like both high enough to where you can run minions whenever you want to. There we go, and now there's a quest to come over here and sneak around and do stuff, and I kind of hate that quest, so kind of annoying. Uh, bizarre. Hey, uh, where's the rest of the people I'm supposed to talk to? That's the entrance to. Weird. Maybe they're up here. There's Ellie. There we go. There's two more. They'll have a little sparkles above their head. Are you a hero? Okay, so let's go talk to Ellie. We're not going to be joining this one, so we're going to go back, back to the mage area and talk to Ellie. Oh, I about did it. I about did it. I went the wrong spot.
There we go. I love this shovel. So you've talked to a few villagers on both factions. I hope you know which faction you want to join, but don't worry. You'll be able to change factions if you want. However, changing factions usually means that you will become unfriendly to the other faction. And it gives a choice. Barbarians or mages? We're going to go with mages to start out with. Hmm, so mage faction then. I'm not going, it's not, it's not going to be easy to join them. The first, first you have to prove your worth if you want to have a chance to join them. Hmm, let me think. Oh, I know what you should do. The Tiki people really like educated individuals. If you can bring them back a book or a piece of technology they have never seen before, I'm sure they would, they will take a liking to you. Hold on a minute. You're losing me there. <laughs> Going too fast. I couldn't help but notice that you come from the place we commonly know as the hub. In which case, you also know Maddox. I've met Maddox. Both Maddox and his brother are, in fact, from Scarlington. But, but contrary... Okay. I already have this. Okay. Hmm. But contrary to the others in other inhabitants, the two brothers were born without any magical aptitudes. Skip something. Hold on. Okay, that's right. In fact, they instead showed that they had immense strength and taste for violence. They got banned from the academy during their first year and even got exiled from the island after the terrible incident. But I, di I digress. My point is they both Tiki and I know for a fact that Antrax is crafting a simple ability phones for his brother. In fact, I have one of them here. Take it. I'll just request another one from Maddox. I keep losing them. Take this to the Dean. Bring this to the Dean of the Academy in Scarlington. I'm sure he will be he will find it most interesting. The cathedral is it, the cathedral got reorganized a while ago. Now the large portion of it is used for the academy. Okay. So. Now we have to take the Abbey Fun, which I believe we have to have in our inventory. So let's take our drill out and put that down there. And the... I always get lost here. But um, we can cheat. We have our mage armor on. The academy's around here somewhere. I always, always forget where it's at. I think it's in here. Or is it up top? It's up top. Auction house. No, it's not up top. I don't know my way around very well. I think this is it. Or I'm just stupid. <laughs> I am. This is back where we started. <laughs> All right. 
No cheat cuts. Any zombies? Cathedral. Here we are. That way leads somewhere else. There we go. And the Dean's office should be up here. There's the Dean. And we... You, you are not one of my students. I hope you are not here to rob me. I could still take a dozen of you young guns like that. Um... Oh, that's not why you're here. Then why are you here? Speak up. I don't have all day. Oh, where did you find this? This looks like an older version of the ability phones, in a way. I wish I would stop doing that. In a way, this is remarkable. Uh, but why do you have this? And oh, are you interested in that kind of magical technology? Yes. Perfect. Well, then you are in the right place. Let's let me write you a letter of recommendation. There we go. First, you should go to the queen with it. We have a very strict code around here and you won't go far without the queen's approval. Hopefully the queen will grant you access to some of the parts of the city. Once that's done, go visit my cousin Odell in his shop in the plaza. He'll let you know he'll let him know you are coming and he'll make you a price on the Abbey phones. They are expensive. <laughs> Okay, so we got the letter of recommendation. That's what we needed. Let's uh, go back downstairs. There's some quest in here that I hate doing. Oh, oh well. There we go. I don't know why I have trouble finding my way down in here. Uh, I just got lost again. Yes, I did. <laughs> what did talk to me? We're, we're cheating. There we go. So, we should be able to go up here now. What does the stranger have to do with the Tiki people? Speak! I have something to show you and... Click. Letter recommendation from the Dean. Let me read this. Hmm. Intriguing, to say the least. I have the utmost faith in our Dean. If they value your company, I'll welcome you I'll welcome you to our faction, but if you are up to no good, I'll revoke your access immediately. Now go. Enjoy our great city. New faction member. Now, we're currently part of the mage faction. That's basically the main quest line. We're going to do a little bit more. Uh, the Abbey phones. They're kind of useful. Long way.
Uh, we're looking for the Abbey Friends shop. I don't think this is him. No, this is the regular shop. This guy does sell some stuff, as you can see. Let me try to remember. Lamps. Nope. That's the fishing rod. Talk to you later. Nope. I need more bottles. More! Um, I might have to pause the video so I can find this person. <laughs> Sorry. Not what we're looking for. This is where you can actually buy potions. So, uh, uh, we actually want one of these, but we need enchanted mycelium first. So we're going to have to get 500 of those before we can get one of these the atomizer. Yeah. And the spore harvester. I'm not worried about that, but uh, what you do is you check on the AH, not the the bazaar, and see how much these are, and then you can come over here and buy the maximum allowed every day. Yeah. So if if you check on the bazaar and the prices of these are above seven hundred fifty thousand, you can come over here and get them for seven hundred fifty thousand and sell them on the bazaar. They're usually not. They're usually not, but it's it's a thing you can do. No, you're not it. I am going nuts. You're the lamp dude. I don't think it's up here either. It's the chickens is annoying too. I might do the chicken ones off camera. I'm not worried about that. Nope. I'm going the wrong way. I keep going backwards. I went up there. That's the fishing guy. Let's go upstairs. All right, guys, I'm going to pause it, and then I'll bring you guys back when I find this person. I'm probably having to look it up. I'll be right back. And we're back. Sorry, guys. <laughs> okay, so... Um, I'm going to have to close his menu again. Hold on a minute. Oh, you must be Magsy. My cousin told me you'd come to my place. The friends of the Dean to are my friends, too. I'll give you a one point five percent this this re cost reduction on all the items in my shop i have a wide range of abbey phones from the abbey x plus to the Ab abbey 13 pro giga buy an abbey phone okay so this is the part here so the cheapest phone here is this 
and they get dramatically uh, more expensive, as you can see. Basically, you, you upgrade them when you buy one. See? You get this one, and then you up, you can upgrade them into these, I guess. Yeah. It's so dumb. Look how massively expensive these are. Anyway, there are different. There are purposes for this. So this is this is the starter one right here. There's eight contacts, uh, or five contacts there. As you can see, as you go, you can put discs in them. Yeah, but your contacts go up as you buy the bigger ones. And, uh, yeah. Do we even have enough money to buy an Abbey Front? I don't think... Oh, we do have to buy one. No, we do not have enough money to buy an Abbey Front. <laughs> We're stuck. Okay. So, we're back to this. <laughs> uh, I do have a booster cookie on, so I can just sell these straight up now. Yeah, let's just sell all of them. I can get more. Not you. Yeah. There we go. And... We'll just buy the starter one right now. We'll worry about the rest of them later. So get an Abbey phone. You need it as part of the quest line. I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of this up because we probably won't need it. There we go. Great. I'll let you know when I have more expensive versions of the same Abbey phone available. Sorry, I mean more powerful versions. <laughs> I'm using air quotes. Of the Abbey phone at the same price. Anyways, Abbey phones are magical devices that allow you to send sounds through towards another Abbey phone. It might be hard for you to wrap your head around that concept, but you'll get used to it. Trust me. Some of them might let you add them as your contacts. If you have someone's contact, you can call them at any time and... They can also call you whenever. I took the liberty of adding the Deans to your contacts already and made sure you couldn't remove it. Accidents happen. Have a, gr have a good day. Make sure you come back later to check my stock. So now I want you to use the Abbey phone to call the Dean. So we're going to do that. Hello. Oh, it's you. So the queen welcomed you to our faction. That's great. Listen, I don't have a lot of time right now. The The object of my current research has just been stolen. I'm sorry, but I have to call you back later. Enjoy. And it says find Ellie. Ellie should be back down here. I almost lose my way here. Uh, no, wrong dude. Um, we're just gonna cheat. Did I go the wrong way again? Jeez. Wait, I have no clue where I'm at. Here we are. Ellie should be in here. Okay, set and go up. No. So it, when you're when you're looking for somebody, 
Um, there's a little arrow. Do you see that? You're supposed to follow the arrow. There we go. So the arrow will turn green once you get closer to where she's at. Apparently she's not in the the town. I'm glad they added this in because it was super annoying. There she is. Okay. Oh, it worked. I'm so happy. And you even got an Abby phone. Take me, take me, take my contact so we can keep in touch. Dang it. Ellie has added her contact to your Abby phone. Nice. So, what's what are you up to? The dean told you his research was stolen. Ah, it's not so surprising. Maybe you don't know, but the piglins are not so fond of the tiki people i do have an idea where the stolen research might be follow me what's taking so long is because i need to read the, the text <coughs> excuse me guys those you don't know i'm dyslexic so my reading ability is not that great Anyway, our overall goal would probably be the sh shimmering light armor. So, jump on top of the mountain there. No. There she go. I think I missed her. There she is. Not oh, my drill stuff on that bar. It's like the most annoying way to get um, sulfur. Okay, talk to Ellie. You see that giant dragon skull inside the barbarian's hut? Yes. That's the skeleton of Jothra, the internal one. The one that caused the destruction of the world. Now, you probably understand why the village in front of it is called Dragon Tail. Anyways, the barbarians built a bastion inside the skeleton. And I suspect this is where the stolen object is guarded. Piglins fear the growing power of the Tiki Kingdom. So they most likely stole it to study the research. Maybe you can sneak in and recover the item without getting seen and creating a major di a diplomatic incident, of course. I am not sure exactly where they keep it, but it's... Make sure that you do not get seen by the guards. I can't help you, however. I have too much to lose, sorry. But good luck. Infiltrate the bastion and recover. Okay, so. It wants us to go over there, so. You basically want to come in here and follow the, the, the thing, but you don't want to get seen by guards, so you have to finagle a way through.
bet you it won't let me teleport. No, it's disabled. Okay, so we are going to have to actually go inside. Hold on. Yeah, be careful. Nope. You didn't see me. They did see me. Ah! <laughs> so we're back at the beginning. This is where you start at. So. guards, dude. Nope. Did this go away? How about that? Nope. I did not go in a restricted area. Liar. <laughs> I was almost there. I would love to, but you... Um, I can't. You stuck me? Yeah. I, I believe... Yeah. I'm going to have to teleport out. Sucks so bad. Stupid glitch. All right, guys. I'm going to pause this. I'm going to get back to where I was. I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, guys. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> he wants us to wait for a call for Abby or Allie, Ellie. This is the going to have to be over soon because i got to get something to eat for lunch before we do run recordings with James. Up to the wards. I don't know I got James on my brain. Hmm. Um, do I wait for the call or do I call her? No answer. Well, yeah. Guess we can leave. There we go. Hello. Are you still alive? Awesome. Have you gotten the research back or did you chicken out? Great. You are cooler than you look. Go back to the Dean and I'm sure this will grant you a lot of reputation. So, back to the Dean. We can actually run this time.
Nope. Sorry, dude. Okay. Might want to get our thing out. Doesn't work on them. Hmm. There's a better spot. There. It's like those are up and running. Find the jeans. The part I hate. <laughs> Oh, no, that's a bad guy. <laughs> that's a death. <laughs> that's what that is. Where am I going? The right way. I think I'm in the right place. I'm just at the wrong side, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. There he is. Uh, the Dean's not here. Let's try down, uh... At the entrance. Here we are. Dean's not here either. Can we just call the Dean? I don't think so. What is it? I'm so stressed out about my lost research. I'm so sure. I believe Piglin stole it. It's a real problem. What did you say? You've recovered it. And... He didn't even see you. Okay. <laughs> Luckily that worked. Hold on, guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. Visit the mage council. That's down here. There we go. Oh, Magzi. You're here. There, you're the one who retrie retrieved the research. I see. We owe you a venture. This object is of great value to us. Yes, indeed. With it, we were able to extract salt from the netherrack. It will be a massive asset for cooking. You see, while we evolved past the need for crops and cattle, the quality of our food remains low. I would say close to 50% of our research is still spent Fifty percent of our research is still spent on food artifacts and machines. Once again, and once again, those piglins stole our research. They believe we were working on war engines. The tension is rising, and soon we might have to cross swords with them. Captain, what? 
I don't know what that is. This isn't the conversation we should have right now. Thank you. Very much, Magzi. Magnus Meyer. Would you mind leaving us for now? We have other matters to discuss. Magzi, please meet me back in the academy. We have a lot to talk about. And we got a hundred uh, reputation. So meet meet them back in the academy. That's fine. Hopefully he'll be there this time. But let's see if we can remember this this time. God, it's been so long since I did mage stuff. Uh, here. And we go here, up the stairs. No. Already lost. How bad it is. What? What happened? That was weird. Oh my god. I'm so bad at this in here. No. Yes. Got it. Go ahead and open this. I can't thank you enough. What you did was heroic. You're probably aware, but we used to be pig farmers. But sulfur turned the pigs into piglins. For decades, we had to survive on almost nothing to eat until we learned the magic. Piglins can eat n nether warts, but we certainly can't. Anyways, if you want to learn more about, there are books in the Academy regarding the Dark Ages. I'm trying to finish my work on machine on, on this machine, but my apprentice is missing. He's out there in the wilds looking for precious ingredients, and he should have been back a long time ago. Their Abbey phone doesn't seem to be working. I am starting to get worried. Would you be so kind as to look for them? They are probably north of the Red Sand Desert. So, I think what I'm going to have to do is end it here, guys. It's been about an hour. Uh, we're going to continue this next week. I still am not doing any of the Rift. Uh, because, as I told you, the Rift is a big update. They are planning on having more changes on it. I want to do it when uh, all the changes are, you know, pretty much in place. And they're not going to be changing a lot, you know, that kind of stuff. So, I would rather wait and do that for you guys whenever the content is complete complete i'll do use air quotes on that complete complete so probably next week um or after bingo we'll see we'll see anyway guys if you like this episode make sure you smack that like button it really helps out the channel with youtube views youtube searches youtube algorithm movement for the channel if you subscribe to my channel and you want to get notifications when I have new videos out, all you got to do is go to my page, hit the notification bell, set your settings inside the notification bell. You'll get notifications whenever you want them, not just whenever YouTube wants to send them to you. You can come check out the videos. If you do like this video, you want to share it with your friends, tell them what you like it. There's a share tab down below. Click on the share tab, copy the note, copy the link, post it on your Facebook, Twitter, wherever you do social media. If you have any tips, tricks, or comments, put it in the comments down below. Don't forget to follow me on social media pages. Don't forget to set your notification settings to the channel, use the notification bell. Um, I'm going to go back to my island and set that stuff up, and I'll see you guys later.